Let me go Hanji. It's a thousand ice there. Thousand yard? Yeah. Thousand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the other. It, it would the be. Other, it would be double that. So it would be two thousand. The other unreleased fusion monster from Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> <It, it, laughs> oh, I was thinking. Okay, that's soon enough. Since, w- she, since she's wearing glasses, also it'd be two thousand. <laughs> yeah. I was thinking that monster from the original Power Rangers. <laughs> yeah, I remember that guy. <laughs> Welcome back to Attack on Titan. Let's see what Hanji needs now. <laughs> Nine hundred and ninety-eight more eyes for that stare. <laughs> <laughs> They never get the shots right. They would say "you who" and she went like "you who who." <laughs> it's a bad, bad, uh, bad subbing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, okay, like, okay, Uncle, do you know the um, do you know the anime um, vamp um, Rosario Vampire? Yeah, yeah. So I I bought that, and it's literally the Japanese version, but when I put it on subtitles, it looked like it was done in Google Translate. <laughs> is it, oh, it's bad subbing. Oh, it's wow. really oh, bad subbing. I, like literal translation. I, I guess. I, love I have. I have it some bad the, subbing at home that I can bring you. Reminds what, me of the first. Is, it reminds me of the first beta that um Google launched and Brain Scratch took full advantage of that Resident Evil Four. Oh uh, yeah, never forget what in Ronald Rakewell. <laughs> <laughs> I like physics. <laughs> yeah, I've Why? got I've got some uh, uh translations of. Initial D oh, yeah. that were oh, okay. like bad. Oh, you want to know bad? Tag Force Special. Oh, bad. money shot. Oh, no, he's a, he has a, he, he's a T Rex. He has little arms. Shot. That didn't do anything. Yeah, Bitch. because like I showed him. Could have gone for his eye. Yeah. You're welcome. Frankly, Assuming you were half eaten. It didn't yeah. even look like you were getting eaten. You were just like you were being sucked on like a lollipop. <laughs> he's mean? dead anyway. Yeah, no, you know if you think if you think about it, we're suck for lollipops. We're sucking on our own saliva. Mm. Yeah, but now it's like now it's fruity saliva. Yeah, exactly. I drink that. <laughs> and we're back in the city again. In a city. I really think there's only the one city. There's it, multiple cities. It's just, no, they're hidden behind somewhere else. several walls. Just notice, this game looks like it's trying to run at 60 frames, but it can't. He Levi's too much for it. Yeah. <laughs> he uh, he alone. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm sorry. That was it, it was too raunchy for there? mature audiences. <laughs> Your discretion that, was advised, and you ignored it. That's the entire series if you edit it. <laughs> Right before they slice the nape, it cuts to a <laughs> random bypasser. There used to be the four uh, kids version. Well, there used to be a joke. I forget exactly what it was, but it was uh, oh, it was like it was Sopranos edited for the pack. Oh, oh yeah, Matt, yeah, yeah, Matt yeah. TV. That was yeah, <laughs> but it, funny. Yeah, they no. were like a minute long. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you Tell you what, you why don't fuck. you stop breaking my butt? Bu- <laughs> you fu- 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 <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> Yeah, that was one of my favorite. That, that's one of the sketches. that was one of the best sketches ever. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, I'm out of gas. <laughs> Hang on. Look at us. Oh, I'm gonna get, get you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you. you. I got you. Oh, thanks. He was so slow. Yeah, cause I'm out of gas. <laughs> that should mean you don't go at all. <laughs> <laughs> just pure willpower. Yeah, just he's just flying on willpower. <laughs> they don't see me coming. <laughs> 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 it's powered by my own sense of self-accomplishment. <laughs> what? Oh <laughs> shit! Let me try to roof down. Jesus! <laughs> just, to, just imagine the insurance premiums here. Ah, damn it! Is it any worse than anything? Oh no! Sa- Sauce is in trouble again. <laughs> Help, Sauce! Ah! Got him! Oh, I missed. Can you just kill her off? She's just annoying as shit. But it's Hanji. Okay, take it easy there, Titan. <laughs> yeah, feed her to a Titan. Make her meet Mr. Smiley or something. No. Dude, she's, she's that ev- she is every fucking general in every horror movie ever that wants to study the monster and fails to realize why nobody's been trying to do that. Name five. Yeah. 
Yes, but alien, she's, alien but she's two, delightful. Alien three, Not alien. from the same that's, franchise. That's, cheating that's from the bullshit. Same right there. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, I need gas. Hang on. Let me let me shoot him. <laughs> yeah, Ow. right in the stomach. Ooh. Right up the taint. <laughs> and it's blue taint paint. <laughs> right up, right up the Hershey Ew. Highway. <laughs> Taint paint? It's a taint paint. <laughs> that, that's a new Splatoon mode I'm not familiar oh, with. Oh, Jesus. Was it, was it Splatoon after dark. Wasn't that a something awful? Like, it was, it was, um, was it cracked. Gummy, was it gummy bears or something? Yeah, like gummy bears. It was <laughs> Wait. Gummy bears what? There was the show? On the, on the something awful form. Was it, was it, I don't know if it, it was, was cracked. A, I don't know if it was, it was a cracked or something like that, yeah. but it was like a yearly thing where people would take... Uh, you know, popular products, and then relabel it for what they're really known oh, for. Yeah. Oh yeah! And I think gummy bears was just taint paint for some fucking reason. <laughs> <laughs> now they're uh, al alcohol shots now. <laughs> gummy With bears. Gummy bears. Uh huh. You soak them in vodka overnight. Oh yeah. I've never. All right. I've never heard of this. Oh yeah, it's awesome. I've heard of it once. I never tried it. I tried it. It's it's good. It's not the life changer. I, I like haven't had it. gummy bears in such a long time. Because your paint's not colored no, differently. Yours mine. What? what? You, mean my, you, mean, you mean his you mean, taint? You mean my taint. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Did I say paint? You said yeah, paint. You said I said paint. paint. Yeah. I wonder if they call them gummy Kodiaks in uh, what is that? Is, is uh, Eskimo? Are they Kodiak up there? In Inuit language? <sighs> I don't know. I wouldn't know. I, would know. Yeah. I would think so. Or Kodak. <laughs> Kodak. Kodak's a camera uh, that's company. That's the camera company. Hey, all right, Harley's Kodiak. It's Kodiak, yeah. Kodiak's the bear. Kodiak, yeah. Yeah. It's also the. Uh, it's also a um, brand of snuff. Okay. Yeah. Fuck. I want. I need gas. All the time with you in this gas. Like, <laughs> I'm sorry. I like to eat. Man. Jeez. And then we have to ah, pay a good for Tinder. it. That's an honest Tinder profile. I, I like to eat <laughs> a lot. <laughs> You're gonna be cleaning me with a rag on a stick. Other than that, we be down. So you see what the girl was thinking. Oh, you mean must be eat, eats a lot of pussy? Like, no, actually, I just like to <laughs> no, eat. no, no, just no, food. Actual, actual food. food, actual food, actual food. I actually decided to fuck around one time with the um, my fitness app once. Because you can actually, it's it's like one of those apps where it's like a calorie counter, but it's contributed by people. So I put pussy. <laughs> How many calories did it say? Five. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to Christ, Elliot, I thought you were going to fly right into his mouth. <laughs> as long as he flies out the back. Very, very interesting game over. <laughs> Munch. No, that's a new way to kill them. You, got, you fly in their mouth and fly at the back of their neck. Cut, cutting your way out. It counts as sitting in the nape, sure. Yeah. Are Titans Tauntauns now? I don't know, but they might smell bad. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, that was nice. Beautiful. That quick back and forth. The Bob of the couldn't, Week. Couldn't have been healthy for him, but... If there's a character in the show that is known for forcefully going inside a Titan's mouth and coming out the back of the neck, that character's name should be Jawbreaker. <laughs> <laughs> Deep throat. No. Demon Throat. Throat would probably be more appropriate if it attacked from the stomach anymore. Yeah. No, uh, uh, Jawbreaker's nickname is This Isn't Gum. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, slow, slow burner. Everybody's flashing back to that time they had a Jawbreaker and didn't yep. realize it wasn't gum. And paid for it. <laughs> I worked at a skating rink and they had one of those big gumball machines. They weren't but gum. Was, yeah, but it was all jawbreakers, so we had to keep a sign on it that said "not gum." A skating rink? Which one? Uh, it was called Wow. Oh, oh, I, I, oh remember. I remember. Wow. I remember yeah. that. Yeah. I work. I worked there for it was about down a year the, uh, near the boulevard. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. I worked there for about a year. That was a. Uh, so you really worked at Wow? Yeah, I was the. Wow. I became the arcade manager there. Oh, of course. And that was. <laughs> oh, I had so many conflicts with them though. It was not a pleasant place. Why you well, kept it, winning? It was a pleasant place. No, they the games were owned. Half the games were owned by another company uh, who, yeah. who wouldn't give us access to the games. So I'd walk around with a roll of duct tape taping up games that didn't work. And they used to get mad at me and say, you can't do that. And I'd tell them, the game's broken and you're not giving me a key to fix it. 
I was sad for the games. But they would keep the quarter slots open or something Yeah, the like they, would, they would want me to keep the quarter slots open uh, even though the games were broken. Uh, that's skeevy. So I would, I would tape them up so that people couldn't play them. Yeah, that's skeevy. And then they would shit. get mad at me for that. That's literally highway robbery. It, yeah. it was really bad. I, was, I felt bad for the arcade games. Hmm? Should have whistled a little. Nah, I, I just... I, I argued and argued until eventually they started giving us keys so that we could at, at least the clear day, the machines to, out. At the end of the day, you didn't want to lose your job. Yeah, you know, I wasn't... I didn't want to do that, but I felt bad for the arcade games. And not the people that got ripped off? Uh, the people that got ripped off, we just gave them another quarter. Ah. Like, whenever they complained, we just gave them another quarter and then I taped up a machine. Or another token, I should say. Yeah, they didn't do quarters. Yeah. But yeah, I was, I'm one of those guys that likes to take care of that equipment, you know, that stuff. I, I like the idea of video game preservation, and I, I like the idea that these that video games, they need their history. They need to be taken care of. So I hated the fact that they just treated them like junk. Well, that's funny. On, on that note, then, because, you know, we're, we're doing the same show, but don't think the last six parts. <laughs> you like uh, video game preservation. What's your opinion on video game restoration? Uh, like, do you, do you find the idea of, like, do you find it tinkering with the uh, original idea, it, or would you rather, like, be restored to normal? Uh, oh, you, you're you talking about, like, uh, replacement parts and yeah. stuff like that? For, like that yeah. uh, it's funny, because in I know in the pinball community, they, functionality is their biggest issue. Yeah. And so they like the idea of new parts and stuff like that. I like the idea of trying to keep things original if you can. I like the I like the the exterior stuff to be original, on but the interior parts I, I don't mind replacing old solenoids with new solenoids and you know ones that are more functional. Yeah, televisions fo follow a similar principle. It was something I learned myself. Is um the reason why there are so many remote codes or why there are so many codes to program your television remote to work with the um or rather the cable remotes to the television is because multiple televisions you have are made with component parts from other companies in mind. Like this Vizio you have here, for example, it could have a Samsung part in it or an LG part in it or something like that. As long as the thing functions, they will happily reuse the Frankenstein of components. Yeah, exactly. I don't, and I don't mind that as long as it's interior. Exterior, yeah. I prefer, so you, you know, for the video games, I prefer them to look the way they did before. Like, I wouldn't put it this way, going through a pinball machine and changing out all of the incandescent bulbs to LEDs. As long as everything looks exactly the same, I have no problem with that. So LEDs are going to last a lot longer. New inside, midget outside. Yeah, I don't mind that, except for uh, video, like cartridge video games. I uh, change the capacitors, no problem. If you're gonna if you're gonna put a new chip in it, that seems a little weird to me. Or, or at the very least, replace the save battery. Yeah. Yeah, because you have to do that after a while. Yeah, they all. Yeah, I, yeah. Save batteries. Especially I have no with problem Game with regular Game Boy games. Game Boy games, I think, are the worst of it. Like, yeah, I, yeah, I still, I still have a copy of Pokemon Yellow, but the save battery is still dead. Yeah, Mine and, is, and then I have Super Nintendo games like the like release day Super Metroid, and it still saves. Oh, uh, it's weird though when that thing goes off. Yeah, that one. Well, Super Metroid in particular breaks. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Because yeah. uh, that's what happened to my cartridge. Yeah, if yeah, if your save battery, for those that not know. Breaks Super Metroid. Uh, the moment you load up the game, Samus immediately dies. Yeah, like her health drops to zero. You can't like, save, you so can't, you can't try. You, yeah, you can't save, you can't play. That's the way the game works. Yeah, which that's why I don't mind changing that, stuff like that. That sounds like games in a nutshell. <laughs> like I know that uh, I know that there was a big stink recently with labels, changing out the labels and stuff like that. And that's that's when you start to get into a kind of gray area. What, what do you mean by changing labels? Re repro labels. Oh yeah. Making oh. making all new labels that look ex that are made to look exactly like the old. Well, I mean, if the old one is damaged beyond repair, then I don't see the problem. I yeah. If I, you know if you know what you have is the real deal, well, then getting a label replacement I don't think is a big deal. Well, the issue there becomes what happens in the day when you sell your games or something happens and these games enter the market. And now they have repro labels on them without anybody saying it. It's a repro label, but that's it's not a repro game. Yeah, I, you know? I think, and I think that that I think that there's a lot, there's a big bunch of subjects there because a lot of the time repro labels indicate repro games. I think, I, but like, I feel like if you like change the label to a repro label, you kind of like 
raise suspicion that like people might not that's believe why. that it's, it's why that's if, the you're, if you're holding a copy of wild guns and you and you can tell it's a repro label you start to question whether or not the game is legit that's when but, you, uh, that's when you, you check op- inside yeah, it. you open it up and you check and you're fine yes right you know yes it's going to drop the cash value but if you're someone who I, I don't worry about the cash value of my games because with with any hope, I won't ever have to sell them. Yeah, like I, de- I definitely don't plan on it. You're collecting them. You're not, yeah. You don't plan on selling yeah. So, you yeah. know, I want them to look decent. But, yeah, at the same time, if and then it becomes the issue of how much it's torn. You know, there are labels out there that have small rips on them and people will replace it. There's no point in that. There are the labels where the entire label is ripped off and all you've got is the white sticky part. The value of that game is destroyed anyway, so why not just change the label? Like I have, I have um Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga on the GBA, and I want to replace the label of it because it's like coming off, you know. See, it, it's funny for that. I would probably just glue it down. I'd probably just throw a little crazy glue under there and glue yeah. it down. But yeah, there's the games out there where they have marker written on them with, with the name of the game because there's no label whatsoever. Yeah. You're not really changing the value of that particular copy of the game if you put a repro label on it. I couldn't make it to ten and a half. No, it's still got all S's though. <laughs> and also, um, doing a little research on my own here on Levi, he's apparently a real knee freak, which is making the parts where he gets drowned in blood really inconsistent. Yeah, we brought that up. Yeah, we brought yeah, that yeah. up. Yeah, we were talking about that. We went on an entire remember? Mark Summers double dip. Yeah, he was yeah. <laughs> he literally did. <laughs> it was Mark Summers. Were all you right. asleep? <laughs> no, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Matt, uh, uh, Matt doesn't believe in repro labels, so he's <laughs> there, there's two high rank specialized statement of deployments. Oh, awesome! Now we can go and get that sword that's probably overpowered by now, or outdated. Or outdated yeah, outdated. Yeah. I should say. <laughs> yeah, I mean that whole subject of the the boot the the, the idea of the bootleg like game market and everything it entails is is probably a, a much bigger topic than an episode of Attack on Titan. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you say that, we have to end today's part. Yeah, yep. exactly. So we will continue on with this mission here. Uh, what entails? Well, there's, I don't know. <laughs> there's, there's, <laughs> are we? Will we be saving the double penis right there? <laughs> that the, looks like a double the penis. Twin dongs. It's the two towers. Twin, twin dongs. This is the Return of the King. I don't know. I like twin dongs. That's a that's a new Brazzers movie. <laughs> it's a Bang Brothers movie. <laughs> get, get, Levi gets on the Bang bus. <laughs> we'll see you for the next part of Attack on Titan. Bang.